This your boy Z Bands, and you tuned in with the voice of the youth, Taco Talk TV. Hey, look, man. It's your boy Taco from Taco Talk TV, voice of the youth, all of that and some more, whatever you, whatever you needed to be. That's what it is. Um, we sitting here with a good man today. What's yeah, up, bro? Man. What's your name? Man, Z Rock Bands, man. They know who it is, man. All right, so now, like. When I first heard of you, it was just Z-Rock. Where the bands come from? More money now or what? Yeah, man, the bands just come from, man, more money, man. Not even just that, just more, you know, just more levels, man. Just, you know, a new me, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So man. that's just what it is. What about, what about uh, Z-Rock, just the, the name? How you come up with that? The name Z-Rock, man, you know me from, from me being from Robinson, you know what I'm yeah. saying? And, you know, me being around 53rd, a hood called 53rd, I, uh, which I like uh, Southeast, Northeast. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They basically, you know, gave me the, the gave me the, the name Rock. So yeah. I basically took from where I'm from and you know combined it together and was like, man, that's my name, Z Rock. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Cause, oh, go ahead. Yeah, cause you know, yeah, man, I was just doing a lot of shit around it. So they was like, man, we can call you Rock. So that's where Z Rock came from. Do you think like growing up in the hood? Like I think a lot of a lot of people in the DMV like grow up in the hood. Do you think that helped you when you wanted to be a rapper? Like those experiences or just the stuff that go on in the hood. Yeah, man, because I just wanted, you know, to show people that, you know, our struggles and, you know, it's still talent and it's, and it's real artists, you know, people that really, really, you know, care about music and, you know, just love doing music and just love their craft. Yeah. You know, it just don't matter where you're from, you know, it's all over. Yeah. It's, it's talent everywhere. I respect that. Um, and, and what was it like for you when you first started rapping? Did you jump in and he was like, oh, yeah, I'm like that? Or... Do you feel like because now you've been rapping for a while so what you what you think of your your first coming out z-rock to this now z-rock i feel like the first coming out z-rock they already know i was at they neck you know what yeah. I'm saying? they know the first coming out z-rock but i feel like now this z this z-rock now like that's why i'm, I'm z bands because you yeah. know it's just a different me like yeah. i'm just on something different you know what i'm saying yeah i ain't letting up on these niggas in what what I'm just showing them What's the difference? Like, what's the if you could describe it in like one or two words, what would you say that difference is? Is it like more of a grind? Is it more money, more inspiration? What's that? What's that? That thing? The word that I can say, man, is just I'm saying it's just a struggle. You know what I'm saying it's just yeah. a struggle. I'm just showing, yeah, like my struggle, like where I'm coming from. Yeah, 20, 2017 ended. You know, you's coming real hard. Yeah. Twenty eighteen, you coming harder. What? What what's driving? What's your inspiration now? Well, basically, what's driving me? You know, my family, my mother. You know what I'm saying, got a lot of people depending on me, even the people around me. You know what I'm saying, yeah, they really my my biggest inspiration. You know what I'm saying, they make me like go out every time. So yeah, you know, just basically the people around me because I know they want to see me do it just as much as I want to do it. So. Yeah, and, and do you think it's hard for you to to come in and get other people to like believe in your dreams? Like, how hard has that been for you? I mean, I don't really think that's hard because, it, you know, it's a lot of people, you know, they, they give me my props, you know. And, but me, still, I feel like I can be better and I still yeah. should be, you know, I can, I can work more. But, you know, people show me and they show me love, so. Yeah. But I don't really, you know, take it to my head, you know, I just got to keep going. Yeah. Now, um, now, you got a lot of, you had a lot of music out, you know what I'm right. saying, a lot of videos. Um, but can you walk me through the process of what it's like? When you create a song, like, what, what's that process like? Man, it's like me being like on a block, you know, just catching a play. Like, you know, it's like a great feeling. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Matter of fact, even better than that, because you know, it's just music taking me just to another place. You know, yeah. that I just see myself like, you know, what I'm saying, it's in my happiest moments, in my, in my, you know, my best days yeah. when I do my music. So, you know, music just a big part of my life. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Regardless of the lifestyle that I live. Yeah, I respect that. Do you think that it's been, do you think it's been a challenge to to find a flow that you can call your own? Or you think you had that from day one? Oh, I had that from day one. Yeah. And I ain't even being cocky, like I yeah. had that from day one. And that's why I show people, like, I even give them the melodic sound, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Just to show them that, you know, I'm original and I'm giving it me. I ain't yeah. scared to be me, you know what I'm yeah. saying? A lot of people want to be something they not. I'm going to be me, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And niggas going to respect it. I respect that. I definitely like that. And I think a lot of people will respect that. Um, but going back to the selection of of how you create a song, when you start off with beats, right? What kind of beats is the ones that you like, oh yeah, this is under Bangle or 
what what makes a beat stand out to you? I mean, it's basically on the instruments and the, and, the, and, the, and the beat. You know what I'm saying? I just listen to a lot of beats. You know, it's a lot of beats that really catch my attention. You know, I just like different type of styles. You know, just to give them a, yeah. a different like look of music. Like they want see a person like me come from where I come from yeah. making the type of music that I make. Okay, okay. That's a real that's a real like dope thought process behind it. Um and you said the instruments, what kind of instruments are you looking for? You looking for drums, horns, guitars, like what what or keys? All that flutes, all yeah. that. I love all type of sounds. Alright, which one which one do you ever go through a beat and you'd be like, alright, this one to be way tougher if it had a, a flute here or, you know, a drum here or whatever. I mean, yeah, but I just be making the best of it, you know, what I got, but I just be one of them, them you know, good producers, so, yeah. you know, I'm going to just show niggas what I'm going to do. And then, all right, so the next step, would it be would it be writing or would it be just freestyling, recording, what you, how you how you do that? You know, a lot of niggas be really be lying, though, but I, I know be freestyling. <laughs> yeah. Like, niggas can pull up on me. I, I ain't going to lie, I punch in. Yeah. I just punch in, bar from bar, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Just, you know, I, I, that's how I get a chance to talk about shit I really just did. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I don't lie about it. It's, it's all the truth. Why you think Why you think niggas be lying about freestyling? Like, it's no, you know what I'm saying? Like, who said that writing is a bad thing? You know what I'm saying? It's to the point that niggas need to lie and be like, nah, bro, I freestyle everything. I think it's actually, when you want to get, like, your better word, but I think it's actually, to me, better to write. Yeah. But you know what I'm saying? When you when when it's a pain song like the songs that I make, or when it's a struggle song, yeah. and you give it your heart, you don't really need to. You know what I'm saying? You don't really need to do it that way. You can yeah. just go as you know what I'm saying. Yeah. Give it to them how, they, how it is. You know what I'm saying? And I heard somebody say before that for them, it's a lot easier to just you know go off the top than to try to sit down right here and try to all right this go right here and then you lost what you was about to write down. You ever right. experienced that? Yeah, plenty of times. Actually, all the time. Probably yeah. the last time I was at the studio. But I be feeling like, man, if I lost it, that means that I was going to make something better. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So it wasn't meant for me to have it on there. Yeah. That's all right, look at it. Um, and, and how long does it usually take you to, to knock out like a high-quality song? To be honest, it really depends on the feeling. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. That's how it is. My... my, my uh, my drive be based on like how I'm feeling. Like yeah. when I come to the studio, like man, shit, I'm feeling like this, or I had a good day on the block. So yeah. it basically depends on how I'm feeling. You know what I'm saying? I just go off of based. I go based off of that. You know what I'm yeah. Do you think it's a uh, a recipe for bangers? I think I got the recipe. For real? Yeah, I really think I got the recipe. But you know what I'm saying? We ain't gonna talk about it. We just gonna show it. Yeah. All right. So what? What's What's something that people can look at this point and they can pause the video and be like, all right, boom, let me type this in because this is on the bank. You sound like what song? Yeah. Man, they know what, uh, keep it on me, yeah. uh, wait on me. Yeah. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Remember me. Yeah. And we even got Jones that I ain't even shoot videos for. Yeah. The streets don't love you. People know I got classes that went platinum in the streets. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? For real. My, my favorite song by you so far is this joint with, uh, it's on it's on HB tape. HB did a tape. It's uh, oh, yeah, Aaron, listen, isn't it? Oh my, that listen, joint goes listen, so yeah, crazy. Be, and I don't even be really be tripping off that joint. I sound like it wasn't a good song, but that joint I just be like, yeah, that joint cool. But I got a lot of you know feedback off that song. Do you I, think? Do you think your energy was different? Like you wasn't going about it to for it to be a hit. You was just like, all right, you know, I'm knocking this joint out. Yeah, I was a little younger too though. But yeah, I was in the studio for a minute with the joint. That joint cranks so hard, bro. <laughs> like, and that, that's the time when I was telling you, like, I heard this joint and I'm looking for a whole bunch of music by Z Rock at this point because all it takes for me is, like, all right, let me find one good song and then I'm going to go and I'm going to listen to you. But I think that was, like, what was that? What was that? Um, the end of 2016, that joint came out? Or the, or the middle of 2017? Yeah, that's about right. I think it's about right that time. Yeah, should be. Do you, do you ever think about making more music with Lizzo? Or, like, you know, why you think why you think that joint stood out? Actually, I ain't gonna lie to uh, HB. That was really through HB, you know what I'm saying? Cause, yeah. you know, man, through man, his relationship. So yeah. he was like, man, I want you on this record. And you know, I just did it. Yeah. It's what was it like the first time you met HB? You know, it was cool. You know, it took it took time for him, you know, to really get to, 
you know, understand my sound and understand like how I wanted my music. But yeah. you know, he a good patient dude, you know. So yeah, we we definitely click. Yeah, yeah. After that, you know, what I'm saying, it ain't take that long. We got. Um, let's talk about the tape. Last tape that you just dropped. Um, what's it called? Uh, it's called Do What I Do Too. Uh, and now, why why uh, bring that concept from the first one to the second one, and not just like a new a new idea, a new topic? Because I really feel like people can't do what I do. So yeah, I just want to keep their name just pushing out there. Yeah. Then people going 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 know why I said it. What's the story behind it? It sounded like you just gave me like a short version. What's the what's the extended version that people can't do what you do? Well, basically, man, you know, it's just a different type of coming from the trap to the rap, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Just one foot in, one foot out, you know what I'm yeah. saying? And just maintaining, just doing both of them, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know, just living in the city, you know, where, it, where it's real, real rough at, you know what I'm saying? And you trying to be a rap star, so, yeah. you know, it's just a lot of attention and it's just a lot, you know, it's a lot of hate, so. What was the uh, the selection process like for the songs on that tape? Because I looked through them and I seen, like, like for me, I like to listen to the songs with the features first. Right. And then I go through and be like, okay, I'll listen to this song. What was that? What was that selection process like? Did you have like a whole bunch of songs in the vault, and then you was like, all right, you know, boom, 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 picking these joints out, or was it like, oh yeah, these joints is bangers, let's go with these? Well, it was basically like the bangers. Yeah. You know what I'm saying, I just want to give out all good songs. You yeah. know what I'm saying, good quality. You know what I'm saying, when I drop it, I want them to feel it every time. It's never the time I want to drop a song that they ain't feeling. Yeah. And what's your uh, what's your studio vibes like? You know, they be good most of the time, you know. I just gotta come in and, you know, just be focused and just know what I'm trying to do and know, you know, what I want. Do you, uh, do you bring a lot of people to your sessions or just be you and the engineer? To be honest, I really like just me and my sessions. I don't know why. Yeah. Sometimes I don't even like my men in there. Yeah. You know, because I just like to zone out, you know what I'm saying? I just like to give it all to me, you know what I'm yeah. saying? I don't need no playing around, no distractions. I just be one that got to brainstorm it. Yeah, just talk about me. Yeah, yeah, I respect that. And what about um, so the big feature on on do what I want to do too, with money bag yo. I said that's why I said ho money bag. How did that how did that come to fruition? Uh, you know just through you know relationships. You yeah. Know what I'm saying? Through relationships, through good people. Yeah. Basically, but you know that wasn't really too much. But you know, shout out to money bag. Shout yeah. out to you know what I'm saying. Shout out to bread game. Any uh any big features for this uh this EP that you said was about to come out? Uh, to be honest, no features. I okay. just want, like I said earlier, like I'm just trying to give it all to me for real. Yeah. I don't even need no features. Yeah. I show them. I don't need no features. Okay. I respect that. I respect that. Uh, we about to hop into these five random questions real quick. Um, and I didn't really. I ain't write these things down. You know what I'm saying? Normally I write them down, but I didn't write these down. So we just gonna kinda go through and find some random questions and, and see see how you feeling about them. So you been to you been to um Atlanta before, right? Yeah. Have you ever performed out there? No. Nah. Well actually I did for the uh coalition DJs. What what's the energy like from from Atlanta to DC? You know, it's good feedback. You know, they you know, they tell me that my sound sounds similar to the Atlanta sound, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And you think that's true? Or you think it's it's not true? I do think it's true because you know, everybody, you know, get the creativity, you know, just yeah. from you know, rappers period, so yeah. you know, but I just stick to what I know and yeah. stick to my stick to what I do, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I respect that. Second round of question. Who cooks better, your mother or your grandmother? Well, my girl, I never got to really taste my grandmother cooking, but my mother, you know what I'm saying? Be whipping up. Yeah, she be whipping up. She be slumming now and then. Yeah. Um, <laughs> is there any songs that you know by heart that's not your own? Yeah, a lot of songs. Like, I, li I listen to a lot of music, though. All right, give me one right now. I had to stop. Would you sound with the song? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The song? Yeah. Uh, what's your... Uh, who was by? Uh, who was by? I know a lot of songs. This name, anybody, John, I just got this thing of the name, Johnny Single. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That, uh, that, uh, what's, it, what's that jump called? Uh, Myself jump. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's true. I know what I, you know what I'm saying? I know all the little songs that just motivate me. Yeah. Milo. Is that what you listen to? You listen to music for, and it's not a random question. Is it, is that what you listen for? Like you listen for music that's going to inspire you or you listen for music that's cranking or you just listen to listen? I listen to music that inspired me and just listen to, you know, just the different yeah. music that's just going around, you know, because you never, I just don't be want to miss, you know, what other artists, you know, just got to offer, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I just like to listen to all type of music, you know what I'm saying? I don't be doing no hate on nobody. I like to see everybody shine. Yeah. Do you like any other flavor? This is the third round of question. Do you like any other flavors of noodles other than um, chicken? Yeah. Uh, where's my junk with them spicy little turkey? Spicy little chunk, spicy kimchi chunks, the little bubble chunks. Yeah, yeah, them chunks. Do you be saucing your noodles up? Like, <laughs> you be saucing up, like adding your own flavors to them, like you a chef or what? Yeah, yeah. Like what, what you add? Like hot sauce. Well, you know, you from DC, you the hot sauce. Yeah. yeah. Motherfucking seeds and all. Yeah. What else? You might even pitch some motherfucking soy sauce. Yeah. I'm saying you just get to experiment. That should be good. Though. You mess with uh, you mess with soy sauce. Like, what's your favorite thing at the carry out? Nah, nah, I don't eat that shit no more. For real? Why not? Social media and fucked it up. Yeah. Okay. So fuck it up for real. Okay, I respect it. Uh, fourth random question. Um, damn, I just forgot. Uh, I ain't gonna buy shit off this weed. So I was about to say, what's your what's your favorite drug other than weed? Weed. Okay, and what's your favorite strain? Sativa. What's not indica. Indica? Yeah. Alright, those I think I forgot what those are called. What what are those called? Alright, so those is a different size, but I mean like flavors. What's your favorite flavor, guys? Oh OG. Okay. Yeah, and we smoke a whole bunch of other stuff too? Yeah, yeah, I mean I ain't gonna lie. We smoking a lot of OG, you know, that shit just like be yeah, you know, played out all the time. But that's my favorite guys. Would you get some sour D's, some real yeah. sour D's? I ain't been damn it saying that shit, man. It's a real sour D's. And you put yeah. you put fun on your J, right? Hell yeah. You be banging your J's? Huh? You be banging your J's? Nah, these songs don't be spiking. Okay. Because spike. <laughs> I know a lot of people will come back and be like, you know, this song is strike. Uh, last random question. What's more important to you? Being street smart or being book smart? Both. You gotta pick one. If you can only pick one, which one would you pick? Street smart. Why? I pick street smart. Street smart because you gotta think about it, bro. Like when you come from where I come from, bro. Like that was needed. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm not saying that you ain't need school, but you needed to know how to move, you know what I'm saying? Because the wrong move, this shit really like, this shit really like chess, the wrong yeah. move, you know what I'm saying? It could be over. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's why I said both for real, because yeah. you need to be smart, but I really picked the street smarts because you, you got to know how to maneuver from, from the police, man, because yeah. they, they on another level now. They killing us. Yeah. You know, it's do, crazy. You, do you, do you feel uh, obligated, you know what I'm saying, to, to do something about like all the police brutality, or is it just you can do what you can where you can? Basically, do what I can where I can, but I really can't do nothing. Yeah. Basically, you know what I'm saying, I'm just live my life. Yeah. Man, I respect that. Um, that's all for now, man. Nice little interview with Z Rock. Yeah, man. Is it is there yeah. anything you want to talk about that we didn't touch on? Nah, man, I just definitely want to let them know, man. You already know, man. Z-Rock, I'm coming to you hard, man. You already know Yeah. how we coming, man. New music. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I ain't mean to cut you off. What's up with you and JJ, JG Rip? Yeah, that's my dog right there. JG Rip, that's my dog. Yeah, I got to go cook up. Yeah, we definitely going to cook up, man. I'm waiting on him. We supposed to have been cooked up, but you know, yeah. man, him got history, you know, in the trap. You know what I'm yeah. saying? That's my boy, for real. How did, how did you meet him if, it, if it's not like a hot story? Be honest, I met I met JG Riff around the park. I was I, around his hood. I yeah. met him around his hood and shit. I was uh, I was walking through his hood and shit like because I used to stay gambling around it. That's why yeah. I used to gamble when I first started coming around it. You know, a good few folks from my way. You know, yeah, yeah. was locked in with a few folks from around anyway. So you know what I'm saying? That's how I got locked in with him. Yeah. 
and shit. So, you know what I'm saying? I just started seeing riff, riff yeah. music, y'all like be giving you that mood, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, just my shit. Like, yeah. You yeah, know what I'm yeah. saying? You always had that little demeanor, though. But, you know, we just locked in, you know, then we started going to Baloo together, so shit just got locked in. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Different type of look. That's my brother. Shit, too. Hey, 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 hey. Love, I got a uh, straight dropper, rid of my rules, so I had a cop of AI. Yeah, play smart, uh, came a long way from shopping at Kmart. God blessing me, I keep shining. Uh, nigga say he dropping, he lying. Uh, Rats on my feet, gon' be fat, son. Bitch, I know one on the realest that come. Free Jada, bitch, you know how we coming. I got that pressure, it stain like an onion. I'm off the milligrams, I can't function. His girlfriend, the fan, yeah, I wonder. I made 20 bands on one summer. Five beats stuck in the tie, in the hummer. Ryan will riff, I know he gon' crush it. 50 on dip, you know we don't touch him. Rest in peace, the swipe on YC. Real Southeast can ask about me. Went to hop and I know the city gon' feel me. I know some niggas try to kill me. So I got a cop of glick gray weed. Chop with a rap, I do the shit with ease. Uh, mm, mm, mm. Ha, we had free. He cooked on his man, he had the cheese. Pants in my pants, no visa. Catch a place where I receive up. They go broke, they act like divas. I go broke, they not re up. Uh, niggas steady trying to keep up. Say that I wouldn't be shit, yeah. No, I had to thank my teacher. Lose it all for Shaquilla. Can't wait till I get them amps, yeah. Been one away from my nieces. All this little money don't mean none. Want shit, I got my team stunt. Uh, got my team stunt. Uh, what we doing? Uh, uh, get it back in. Uh, you know I gotta get it back in. Uh, I fuck that little bitch, her best friend. Uh, it's a skirt off an action. Uh, 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 you know Z-Bands, I'm into that fashion. Uh, uh, I'm trying to get to this cash in the bank last thing. Oh, yeah. Going there. Uh, uh. Yeah, real freestyle. These niggas can't keep up. That shit was crazy. Z bands, man. You already know how we coming, man. Right. Hey, man. Knocked out a sweet interview with Z Rock Z bands, man. Yeah, Good man. man. Uh, peace out, Girl Scout. Sweet dreams is out of James. Make sure you stay tuned to Taco Talks TV, and we see you around like a donut, man. We out. Yeah.